M0FXB, welcome to my channel. So all my ICOM 705 that you can see in the background and we're connecting to Ham Radio Deluxe. So they're doing a free trial at the moment, which is well worth checking out. Uh, let's just find that for you. There it is, I'll put a link in the description. You get 30 days and you can actually redo this every six months. So I think it's well worth it. Uh, it has so many different features. So let's just uh, show you my connection settings. So here it is, we're all connected. And we'll go file, let's find connection settings a minute. We're actually in, the, actually in the CW decoder section, and this is included with Ham Radio Deluxe. So connect wise, if we click connect, and we'll look at the setting. I've got my 991 connected, which actually, the 991 and Ham Radio Deluxe, they're almost like married, made for each other. Anyway, icon. So let's double click, and we'll show you my connectors. It's already connected, as you can see. So all I did was on right click the device manager, go to device manager, ports, and of course you need the driver for your ICOM 705, which is on the ICOM site. I'll put a link in the description. And I'll always go for the top one, so CRV COM15. And, and this has been factory reset, so it's out the box working. And I just selected COM15, and then I actually put it to auto, and clicked connect, and it just worked. It just connected literally that quick. There's a few errors at first, but eventually it worked. And here we are, if you look at the frequency on the radio, it's changing. And I can change bands. There's no antenna connected at the moment, but you can see I can change bands and so on and so on. And if we change on the actual radio, if we hold go menu, let's turn the memory channel. There you are, 70 sems. Uh, interestingly, let's try DR mode because I haven't actually tried that. So that's DR mode. Now we'll change away and then we'll do DR mode and see if it changes back. It does. So it does, it does in, let's just hold that again actually. Let's just make sure. Hold down again. There you are, that's the R mode. The DR mode, ooh, funny frequency, repeater list, let's just select one. Yeah, so it is, it is detecting DR mode. Don't think I'm brand new to this, I've never used the 705 with Ham Radio Deluxe. There's a lot of included programs. You've got this one here that controls your rotator. Let's go to another window. This one is the HRD logbook, which I've never used. Uh, radio pane, I'm just gonna click OK. So this is the satellite track. Now come on, that's gotta be perfect for um, the ICOM 705, surely. So if we double click here. If you know what you're doing and you, you know, like I don't, <laughs> let's double click one of these. It will actually set it up and put all the frequencies in for you. Now I'm gonna watch some videos so I know exactly how to do this. Um, but there's a satellite there and you can see all the satellites apparently. You've got frequencies there. Now if you double click that, I wonder if how we find the, um, all the different satellites. Well, there's a list there. Let's go down. The main thing is that Ham Radio Deluxe will help you with satellites. And what I'll do, I'll teach myself to do this. And then, what else we got here? I'm sure you probably have to update this. Once I teach myself to do this, I'll try and have a go. Anyway, so like I said, it's um, satellites. It's pretty cool, isn't it? I could spend a lot of time just looking at this. The main one, as you know, is the International Space Station. So you've got satellite window there, logbook, and then the main ham radio deluxe. I notice at the top here there's D Star Chat. What's that? If I just type um, hello, does it do anything? Not by the looks of it. So it must be a you know a setup for that. Let's go. Look at all the different windows. Advanced options, different bands that you can select, band up, band down. You saw it just come out of DR mode. Page down. And it's showing all these bands now, look. 500, oh, you can change what you're viewing. 
favorites quick save marco logbook radio options So it's one of those things that if you get it, you've got to learn it. And as you can tell, I don't, I haven't learned it. But it's linked, it's all connected, that's the main thing. And we'll do some future videos on this. I'll put the link in for the free trial and let me know if you, uh, if you like it. I did notice that when you're on the CWD code the other day, that there was a waterfall. That's tracking that showed up on the CW decode. Now what the CW, what that does, I don't know. All right, so this is a video, just me learning or beginning to learn about Ham Radio Deluxe. Bye for now on the ICOM 705. 73, all the best.